Is that guy is turbo? Is that guy stay on one is really powerful. Let me show you how to play it. Some say it's probably the best hero in the game. Will we create this time, Morton? Small, but it may prove pivotal. Everything in your Yeah, I finally got an Izera game today. I played Izera only like once this patch, I think. Or twice. As the black dragon flight. Let's be efficient. Buy and sell the cats to make space in the tavern. Buy the red whelp. Freeze. Next turn, buy Selemental and buy either red whelp or chroma. And then maybe freeze again. I mean, if I had the insight of like what MMR would be required, I would have camped two weeks ago when I was 12. Uh, so, sorry, when I was 13,400. But I don't know. Realistically, I took a week off to go on vacation. We got a patch and I couldn't adapt well to the new patch. I don't deserve to make top 16 this month and that's fine. But I still have five days to get to a skill level that I can win the tournament that I qualified for by finishing top 16 the previous month. So I'm still having something to look forward to. As well as getting a good rank to get top 16 the next month. So I'm trying to learn something from this. Also next season, I really want to do a smurf account and play two servers. Not only to be safer mentally, but also maybe to go for some crazy 24 hour stream in the last day where I go play Europe and America. That could be fun. Content. <laughs> I'll do it the next season. Season I mean, um, not month, but when we get a new big battlegrounds pack. Rerolling might be better than pocket change, but pocket change is more efficient. Rigor is better technically. I can explain why reroll is better. It's actually a pretty easy explanation. By the way, because I got steward, I don't need to triple the red whelp. Um, the the rigor is three gold and two gold is two gold. I plan on staying on one until I get two gold and chroma wings and two normal chroma wings. Yes, chat. Three gold is more than two gold. Maybe I stayed for too long that I thought that this uh, realization is something uh, big. I feel like Albert Einstein for realizing that three gold is better than two gold. Let us bring this to an end. Aren't Romanians good at math? Romanians are good at math. I'm not that good at math. I mean, I'm decent. I know how to count. Addition, subtraction. I'm pretty good at those. If you look at my MMR today, it's mostly subtraction. That was a reckoning. Not sure if I want to triple the Red Whelp. I feel like it's money wasted. I'm ignoring the Red Whelp triple because let me tell you what I want. I want triple on Chroma Wing and then two more Chroma Wings and then I want a power level to five and then take triple on the third Chroma Wing and on the Red Whelp and discover two Nadinas. Maybe a Caligos. That's my game plan. Is it insane? Perhaps. Will it work? Extremely likely. I might need to level next turn to not lose the next fight. That was a reckoning. Oh. 
You don't sell. You don't sell Steward. You keep it. Trust. Now you can sell Steward because you have another one. This is the board that you want. Now you level. And now let the Hunger Games begin. <laughs> Welcome to Izera. I will be your guide. In a way, I kind of feel bad for like doing this strategy in front of so many people. Because tomorrow I'm going to face it every game. But a lot of other people did it before. So it is what it is. Away the competition. <laughs> you know I, what I find funny? They removed Chroma Wing because people were having some wacky strategies that made it broken. And now people still found some wacky strategies that make the new Chroma Wing broken. But at least now you have to play dragons. I'll buy sparring partner for Nadina. Isn't freezing here high chance to triple Glyph? Um, not really, but you don't even want Glyph triple. I want triple Red Whelp and triple Chroma Wing. And then I want to discover six drops and get two Kalegos and Nadina. I want two Kalegos, one Nadina. And then I want to go Golden Kalegos, two Nadinas. Play a lot of Battle Cries, win the game. That's how I visualize the endgame. By the way, if I get the price that reduces the leveling cost, I can level twice next turn. Just jump to five. Burn away the competition. Nice Leroy nerd. Kill the two two. Dude, I'm gonna kill Galakron. Poor Galakron just died. I feel bad, bad for him. Poor guy got bullied. You are mighty as the black dragon flight. Great deal is actually a great deal. <laughs> One drops, by the way. Why does this work? So, new Chroma Wing starts as a 1 1 and then gets a lot of stats if you have other dragons. But on Izera, you can very consistently get two golden Chroma Wings, two normal Chroma Wings, and then you just power level to 6 and you get this. And on the current turn, nobody can compete with me. So, nobody can compete with me, and I'm Tavern 6. And there's a card called Nadina, the red, that gives all my Chroma Wings Divine Shield. Like, I don't even know if I need Kaligos. Kaligos is like, just a way to scale, I guess, but don't really need it. Old Chroma Wing was way more broken with Cookie Chemist. I think it was broken in a different way. Also, that one was counterable by Leroy. This one is literally uncounterable. Yes. Mm, at least early game. You can outscale it. That's the only counter. You can outscale it mid late game. Seno, thank you so much for the 21 months. I appreciate it. Question, if beasts are in and Quilbor are not in, can you get Agamogan the Great Boar? No. Agamogan shows up with Quilbor, not with beasts, even though he is a beast. Next time, leave nothing to 
chance. I want a triple chroma, but I also want to roll. I don't want to freeze here. I will triple it, but I just don't want to freeze there. And I don't want to double sell, because I don't want to taunt the dragon, I want to taunt Adina. I have time to triple it, it's a one drop, it will happen. So now I'm just looking for Caligos, Nadina, triple red whelp, triple chroma. Red whelp is not permanent, but I want to triple it for an extra discovery. Why was freezing bad? Because you lose two rolls for a minion that you probably get anyways at some point. Like, I'm not even in a hurry to triple Chroma. I'm more in a hurry to triple Red Whelp because I want to kick it. Why would I even want to triple Chroma? A uh, board space. Burn away the competition. Isn't Welp very good to counter Leroy? It's okay, but I don't even care about Leroy that much. Leroy on his own doesn't do enough. That was a reckoning. There's Chroma. And there's Nadina. Go Macau, Nadina. Nah. I'll play Charlie one turn. On sacred ground. Guys, POV. You're Keltas. Nine health. You just dismantled your previous opponent. You fight Izera. Izera has this board. What's the first thing that crosses your mind? Taunting Nadina is bad because of blasters. Um, I mean, I'll get second Nadina. I taunted it just to make sure it dies. The thing is, if somebody plays blaster, that means that they're unlikely to play Leroy. So we're going to play real stats versus real stats. I still think I win in the real stats battle. I lost, but at least I'm not down 300 MMR for the day. Got him. Seize your destiny. Good one. The Flecto just died to Nadina. Crazy. You only have 90% to kill him. Only! Only 90%. Top 4 already. I mean, I'm cleaning house. I don't even think we have time for Kali. But I wasn't told for Kali yet, so... I couldn't even think about it, if I wanted it or not. Maybe Raz is better than Kali? I mean, I think you buy Raz because you don't have anything better. Hire one of these fine recruits. That one hits heavy. Soldiers for gold? How barbaric. Soldiers for gold? How barbaric. I'm trying, chat. What do I think the next hotfix for Chroma Wing is gonna be? Only, Z only Zera can go to this extent with Chroma Wing. So maybe it's more of an Zera problem than a Chroma Wing problem. I feel like if Blizzard has the time, they should just look at 
some of the tribes like dragons, maybe elementals as well, maybe even pirates, and just redesign some minions here and there. It feels like they're trying to fix a problem and then they encounter another problem. It's like me in high school when I was doing my homework. Blizzard is working the same as the Polish government, lol. Well, you can say that they have a well polished machine then. Ice block, right? Am I gonna roll and not find Nadina? My Give me a second Nadina or Kali. Nice. Perfect game. I almost won every fight as well, but it's still perfect game so far. Crazy. The funniest thing is that I don't I don't even think I got super lucky. Like Izera can reproduce this very consistently. That's why it's broken. It kind of feels like Wag Toggle in the body meta. If you guys remember, if you if you guys played back then. It's just consistently stupid. And right now people are, are like, wow, you can do this combo. In like two days, people are going to be like, oh my god, another Rizera. It's one of those combos that once you understand, they're so brain dead. It's so easy to reproduce. But right now it's early enough to still call it Skillful and innovative, right? He buys Chroma Wing and then levels up, calls it a combo. Gamers nowadays, am I right? At least Wag Toggle was never getting first. Next time, leave nothing to chance. Fair point. I mean, this is only getting first some of the time. What am I even rolling here? Can I go Golden Nadina into normal Nadinas? Or is that just blasphemy? I think a Leroy is probably the best, most realistic endgame plan you can have. I don't like the idea of Ghoul. I much prefer Leroy. Ghoul doesn't kill Mackerel. Le Leroy does. Mackerel is one of the few things that I'm still weak to. Okay, I'm just rolling hard for Leroy. What's crazy is that I was not offered one Caligos the entire game. But who needs Caligos anyways, am I right? I don't think I want to buy the Blaster. Leroy is just so much better. Leroy is basically a better Blaster. I feel like it's a mistake to buy the Blaster here. Burn away the competition.
need to win multiple times to win here. I think I'm getting there, but... It's not gonna be smooth sailing. Similarly to Wagtoggle, you just deal 6 plus 1. Buckle up. But yeah, I need Leroy really badly. Hire one of these fine recruits. Atramidis is pretty solid if I cannot get my hands on Leroy. Hello. Is Leroy even better than Atramidis? Soldiers for gold? How barbaric. I think Liwa is better by a little bit. Can I kill him in two so I don't get prized? Because if he gets another prize, it gets a little bit more complicated. I feel like now is the point where he has time to outscale me. I need to end the game as quickly as I possibly can. I'm stuck with the 73 73 chromas. Only scaling I have is Raz. But it's only 8 8, 8 8 per turn. He wasted his Leeway into Nadina. That was a big waste. Killed his map. I kind of Nadina did not fall. That was so good. That was a big win. Big W. We need another one like this. I feel like he needs position so badly. Did he just leave? That was a Is it visual bug? Okay, he left. He just left. Did I leave it another fight? I want my perfect game. Is it perfect game if I concede? I want flawless game. I'm a clown. I mean, his board was terrible. Go for another Leroy. I want to tip the bartender for good luck. 40 health win. Crazy how strong is there I can be. Seize your destiny. Pretty well positioned. Nice and solid, perfect game.